What's up everyone, I'm here to review the Vista Explorer 60 inch tripod. Currently it's only $35 on Amazon.com. Um, I'll link this below in my YouTube description. So for $35 this is actually quite the tripod. Um, I honestly thought that this was, um, it, I didn't think it'd be this big. Uh, it said 60 inches. But I didn't expect it to be this big. So how it works is um, you can extend the legs, and there's um, there's two extensions for each leg. And the way they do it, it's not like each one gets that much skinnier the way down. Um, just like I, just by the the thinness of the steel, I I can barely tell that there's a difference in leg length um, and leg width. Or thickness I mean and um, this right now is about 55 inches it's not fully extended but pretty much there and um, currently I'm uh, I'm almost six feet tall a little bit short like 510 so this is coming up to about my chest like nipple level right now and so uh, you know Here's another great thing about this. It comes with all the parts you want in a tripod. There's a lot of scams on Amazon and other sites where like literally, and I've experienced this before, it says tripod and then you get it in the mail and it's like this small, like literally this small. And that's happened to me twice. And um, this is actually the real deal. And those tiny ones, each of them cost me 10 to $15 and it's, it's, it's one of those things where they scam you with the picture, it looks cheap and so forth. And then people give it good ratings because they want that small tripod for whatever reason. But this is the real deal with all the accessories that um, you want in a standard tripod. You have this thing, it's in like every professional tripod. The purpose of this I believe is so that you can take it off and then uh, there's typically a screw for every video camera underneath and basically um, you can just hook it up and screw it on. Uh, that way you don't have to spin the camera around this thing 50 times. And then you just pop it on here and then uh, lock it into place with this this device here. Uh, it's, it's all its typical stuff, you know, and it's, it's very professional, very clean. This thing, you know, it moves this up and down, left and right, and there's a tightening and loosening s switch, so. Uh, you turn it this way, it loosens dramatically. You t you turn it this way, it tightens. And what tightening does is it makes it harder for you to turn it left or right, up and down. Um, but you guys know you can you guys know how it works. Um, here's where it gets interesting. Um, I did not order this because of it, but uh, this just shows you why uh, certain companies do well because they go above and beyond. So they they added two of these balance things here. Uh, they're the typical balance things you see on uh, tools in um, when you're trying to build something in construction. So uh, there's that little uh, air bubble inside. I, I don't know if you can see, but if you turn this, air bubble moves and you, you kind of want it in the middle, which tells you that it is balanced. So this one's mainly for adjusting uh, this in case you want to. However, there is another one right here which is for the uh, legs of the tripod because as you probably figure out once you buy this, you can have this unbalanced even though it looks balanced because you could extend this leg a little bit too much and it will throw off the de de degrees of the, um, the stand so that everything's flipped. Um, obviously with this thing adjusting here and uh, indicator here, it's not really a problem, but it's just an extra level of protection that I very much like. This one's done differently. It's, it's kind of hard to tell, but there's a, a circular uh, red circle inside here and there's a, a air bubble in there. And basically, um, if, you want, if you want it perfectly, it's hard to tell, but... Um, you want the air bubble at the center of the red circle. It moves around based on the um, like how each how much each leg is extended. And so here we just have like this thing. I, I don't really know what this is, like a handle, I guess. Um, here we got some other stuff. You know, I'm not a expert at uh, using this. I don't need it myself. But if anyone knows what this is or 
needs a professional camera. It's it's very well constructed. Like um, it, it's kind of loose, but like all the pieces are together. Um, I've been scammed two times already. Not really scam, but um, I've gotten some crappy uh, merchandise from Amazon. So this is this is very good. Um, in addition, you know, I very much trusted it with over a thousand ratings on an average of 4.5 out of 5 stars. I just felt like it was amazing. As you can see, it's it's very well constructed here. Um, it's not like it's, you can definitely tell this was, every part was made well and very smooth. It's not like something out of China where every part is chunky and you can tell it, 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 it'll just break apart immediately. Uh, the metal here, I believe it's stainless steel. It may be plastic. Um, it's it's definitely very light. It's so I don't think it's metal or steel. It's it's very smooth though, and it's quite durable at the same time. But I, I'm telling you right now, it is very very light. So I, I'm assuming it's some sort of plastic. Uh, you got the logo here. Um, and right here you have another adjuster so uh, you, you turn it right it loosens up you turn it left or um, in this case clockwise and it tightens up and I believe what this is used for is just adjusting this and by doing so you can actually make it taller and I don't know if this means that you can make it larger than 60 inches which is what it's labeled as or you need to extend this up all the way which closes the legs closer to actually reach the uh, 60 inch category 60 inches is about five feet and so right now this is up to i would say uh, it's it's up to a little bit over my nipples so i would i would label this at like i would say at least 60 inches because i'm 5'11 and there's less than a foot from here to the to okay that's not true it's about a foot from here to the top of my head so this is about 60 inches and i would say um i i would hazard to guess that it is probably and I'm almost certain more than 60 inches because um, I'm 5 foot 10 and there's definitely like there's definitely less than a foot or 10 inches from here to the top of my head so uh, it's it's quite the camera um, but you can see you can get a ballpark estimate of just how tall it can get obviously you know like this, it isn't exactly the most stable. You know, you can knock it over quite easily when you have to extend it so far. Um, but again, it's pretty good. Uh, and you can extend this here and there. And uh, the last thing I want to show you is the bag. So it comes with a bag. And um, uh, it's it's perfect because you like it's it's a good quality bag you know plastic material or uh, whatever this material is you have the the rope for like a backpack sort of scenario and um, uh, it closes up at the front so you can literally close it up and you have this gadget here um, to tighten things or loosen things and here you can just like tighten or loosen it and um, it will close up the top opening and uh, just so you guys understand how it works, you have these latches here. Um, this isn't a latch. L one latch here, one latch here, and that's it. So basically, um, if you unlatch it, you can push one of these legs up to here. And so just to demonstrate, uh, it's going to fall. But as you can tell, this leg has now, let me just open it up. Um, so again, you want to untighten this and then just bring it down and tighten it again just so just to demonstrate you know you can it's very simple it's collapsible and then you you just put it back into place and it goes back up so that's it and um if you like this review uh, check out my channel youtube.com slash will you laugh um that's w-i-l-l-y-o-u-l-a-u-g-h and uh, I'll leave it in the description.